How's it going everyone? Kevin here with Roll On Gaming and look what we have before us here today. We just got back from a last minute full on barge down to San Diego for preview night at San Diego Comic Con. Completely last minute, completely unexpected, completely spontaneous. And we have managed to get our hands on the Star Wars Unlimited convention exclusives. This is the first convention that this product has been available for purchase anywhere. So excited to take a look at this. We're going to go ahead and crack this open, but right away, look, that's my camera. Hello. Hello. The, the box that this comes in, the pictures do not do this justice. This is a fully embossed box here on the front, ridged right here. Uh, we'll, we'll be able to see that a little bit better once we get some of this plastic wrap off, but this just looks absolutely incredible. Uh, definitely. Oh, look, it's my face. Wow. We don't need to see that. Uh, definitely worth uh, the effort made to pick this up. There happens to be a nice little hole here that we're going to go ahead and just poke a little bit in uh, so we can get this plastic wrap off. I got to give a big shout out as I'm opening this up to Xander and Jim, Xander Tabler and Jim Cartwright, of course, who were running the absolutely crazy lines to try to get this product. Um, it was a lot of... Uh, it was a lot of tight compression, a lot of tight quarters, a little bit of pushing and shoving. Again, everybody just wanted to get their hands on this. Uh, a lot of uh, a lot of patience shown by Xander and Jim. Um, really, really awesome to see them there. Um, so shout out Xander and Jim for, for helping me get a place in line. Uh, whether that was intentional or not, I really appreciate it. Um, but this comes right off here, the convention exclusive tab, and just look at the ridging and some of the lines on this. You can see it shines a little bit, that red. This is super, super clean. Almost makes me wish I didn't, uh, I, I kept this sealed because it's super pristine, but I'm definitely keeping the box. Uh, but we also got to see what's in it. So let's go ahead and have the grand reveal here. Again, we're being very careful. Oh, that's nice. Look at that. Okay. We've already got ourselves here. We've got uh, a nice little cover that we're going to lift up to reveal, uh, again, a paper pack here, but a paper pack of these cards. Um, and it looks like, I don't know what this is. It might be nothing. It might be something, but this is really cool too. It's got the unlimited logo, just absolutely clean matte, uh, packaging here looks really sharp. What a, what a quality product for what you pay. Obviously the, uh, the price tag hundred bucks is nothing to sneeze at, but I'm not regretting any second of this. Uh, I'm just going to go ahead and, and, and get these open and see what they look like in person. Again, first chance we've had uh, to take a look at these cards. Uh, all right, so let's start with the one on top, which is Count Dooku. And just take a look at that. Super, super clean. You can sort of see just the, the lining on the foil there. Otherwise... You know, the, the black background with the colors, it really pops. Just absolutely gorgeous. Then there's, of course, Darth Vader. Again, looks super crisp. Emperor Palpatine with the lightning. That looks really good in the look there. Uh, these look and feel so much better uh, in person than photos could do them justice. Kylo there with, uh, with, the, with the sparks falling down. That looks really, really sharp. Uh, these have some weight to them too. They they feel, they almost feel like they're they're just a maybe a, a tiny smidge heavier than regular cards. But I don't actually know if that's true. Uh, maybe it's just the anticipation for what's next. Here we go. Our first look at the set three cards included in the product. Here's a Saj Ventress. Again, just the glow on these lightsabers just makes it look super crisp. And then, of course, they save the best for last. <laughs> I don't know whose decision it was to package it this way, but we approve because saving the best for last, there's Darth Maul. Oh, my goodness. When I tell you that this is awesome to have in hand, uh, you know I mean it. Uh, just an absolutely wonderful piece of art. The red glow uh, really being the only thing that emanates on the card. Incredible. Just incredible. I'm super, super stoked to have these in hand. I'm, I'm definitely, uh, <laughs> I'm definitely gonna have to consider getting more. 
um, because you know having these, you know the 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 photos uh, the art pieces are are bigger than they are on the regular cards, um, and you know they're just highlighted in such a way that yeah I just I want them all I want them all, uh, and I want all the malls as well. Um, so we're definitely going to have to figure out a way to uh, to get our hands on some more potentially. Um, I'm not in a super super hurry to do that um, because uh, this uh, this was a mission that uh, that I was super stoked to be able to take today. Uh, shout out to my wife for hooking it up with some uh, some last minute Comic Con badges. Again, a shout out to all the folks that were working the crazy crowds at the Fantasy Flight Games booth. Uh, especially Jim and Xander uh, for hooking us up there. So uh, I'm going to go ahead and display this uh, in my normal setup. I'm going to take these cards and make sure they get sleeved. Uh, but this has been awesome. Uh, I'm really, really excited to have gotten my hands on this. And for those of you out there trying to get your hands on this, there are four more days of San Diego Comic-Con. Uh, if you were lucky enough to get a badge, be sure to get down there early, early, early. There are only a limited number of these uh, available. And then I know they're going to be selling them also at Gen Con, at Spiel, and I believe PAX Wex and PAX Unplugged. So definitely make sure to get your hands on this if you can because the cards are sick, the box is sick, everything about it is super awesome. Uh, and I was excited to be able to show it to you here today uh, at Roll On Gaming. If you like this content, please feel free to give us a follow. Drop a like on the video. That helps us out a lot. Again, shout out to all the folks at FFG for making this awesome product. And shout out to my wife for uh, giving me a chance to get it. So thanks, everybody, for tuning in. We'll catch you in the next one.